the city to get some fabrics. As I told you, I'm doing Morocco and so I'll be looking for some very bright purples and reds and golds and greens and blues. I don't really have, really have an idea of what I'm going to get yet until I actually see a fabric that I fall in love with. So I'm going to go downtown first to Wolf Home. I saw them at the Architectural Digest Home Show and they were they really had some good stuff so I'm going to go check them out and then some some there are stuff at CG's see if I can get some um some gold tile yeah right and um then I will go to uptown to the indie building Kravitz, Saffany, Rock Lauren, whoever will have mercy on a student and give her some fabric I will go to so I should get going and I hope I can squeeze in some tile and stuff in this trip. Um, can't make any promises but I'll try. This is a World Trade Center bound East train. The next stop is Fifth Avenue. Okay, I have like a million fabrics in here. I'm seeing a lot of things I could use. I don't want it to be done. Like a ton of colors, literally. So I left my money at home and my card was giving me some issues so I had to wait to be rescued for almost two hours so I took in some entertainment. I must have been crazy to left the house without my money but I guess this is where the crazy people hang out anyway. Give me some samples. So I can take whatever I want. Mm -hmm. okay. Just now, all of it. <laughs> no, I won't take all. Thank you. Yeah, let me get your little bag. Okay. Hello. Well, I kind of had a rough day, but I think I pulled through pretty good. Just going to show you some of the fabrics that I was able to muster up today in the short space of time that I went out looking for fabrics. Um, well, I chose some very bright colors. Like in Morocco they tend to use very bright colors so I have turquoise which I love. I love purple as well and I have orange and these I will possibly use as throw pillows on the banquet by the window and I got lots of patterns. I had this from a previous project but I never used it and I think I'm going to use it now. I also have another turquoise piece, which is just beautiful. I got this from Wolf Home. Another pattern from Wolf Home. This has the oranges, the blues. I think it's really pretty. And in Morocco, they tend to use a lot of stars and hexagon shapes. So I got some stars. This is from Andrew Martin. And I also got this from Andrew Martin, which is do you like smaller stars and I got this from Kravit this is a pretty popular Moroccan uh, motif and I wanted to get some more but I don't know if they were out of stock in the different colors but I probably would look somewhere else with this motif again and use that maybe in the living area on a sofa or something like that and neutrals with a room that has all these colors, it's important to have neutrals as well to balance it out. So I have some beiges, some damas. Well, this is neutral as well. Also this. I have a lot of silks and velvets and very rich materials. 
I also have stripes because I want to break it up. I don't want all um, geometric shapes. I also have this really lovely burnt orange material. I love that. I love orange. I love purple. So this is going to be a really fun room to do because I love colors. Okay. So that's the fabric that I got today. I also got a bit of tile, but um, not enough. You saw the, the options that I had with the tile, so I'm probably going to have to go back. Maybe I have to a lot of share around the beds. A turquoise sheer as well. Probably will get a purple sheer as well. Um, I also have a sheer with a pattern, and this pattern has blues and oranges and purples. So, pretty much all the colors that I'm going to be using. So, now that I basically know what my palette is going to be, which is the orange is the turquoise and the purples. Well, this is like a fuchsia, but I can stick it in somewhere, maybe as a pillow because I like it. Right, purple. Now that I know basically what my palette is going to be, I will then choose one color for each bedroom. In instead of making it so busy in the bedrooms, I'll choose one color, maybe do like the master bedroom in purple, and then the other two maybe in like. A burnt orange and the other one like a blue so that the bedrooms are more neutral than the outside. Isn't that pretty?